What's up everyone, this is Max Simplifier. In this video I'm going to be showing you how can you install Windows 8, the consumer preview version, right onto your Mac. We will need to create a virtual machine on which we can install the Windows 8 and the application that we're going to use to do that is VirtualBox. Now you're going to find the download link for VirtualBox in the description below. Please download the DMG file open up the DMG file, uh, send the application to your applications folder to install it and then open up VirtualBox. Once you've done that, you're going to need to download Windows 8 consumer version which is provided for free by Microsoft. Now in the description below you're going to find Windows 8, the consumer version, 64-bit and 32-bit. Download the one that you like and as I said it's provided for free therefore the key code that you're going to find in the description below is ready to be used at on uh, any time and it will always uh, register the product because it's provided for free by Microsoft so once you've downloaded Windows 8 consumer version .iso file and you have installed and opened up VirtualBox here's what you need to do you're going to create a new virtual machine so press on new over here continue then type in the name of the operating system in that case it is Windows 8 consumer preview operating system is Microsoft Windows uh, the Windows is going to be Windows 8 64 bit now depending on what you have downloaded if you downloaded the 32 bit uh, choose this choose this one and if you downloaded the 64 bit like I've done down, uh, then choose Windows 8 64 bit once you've done so, press on continue. Now, for the best performance to be provided by the virtual machine on Windows 8 is to use uh, 2 gigabytes RAM. So in that case, we're going to be using 2048 megabytes to be used so that you can get the best performance uh, that you uh, will require um, uh, on your virtual machine once you open up Windows 8. So once you've set the, 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 the RAM to 2048 megabytes, press on continue. Then you leave everything as it is and you create a new hard disk. Continue. Next, you're going to choose the first option, VDI, virtual, disk, uh, virtual box disk image. Continue. And it should be dynamically allocated. Continue. Once again, leave the file name as it is or change the file name. What, uh, and what, uh, what to, uh, whatever name you want and over here you can choose the destination on which you are going to actually uh, at which you're going to create the virtual machine and uh, the, as for the disk storage it's uh, recommended to leave it as 20 gigabytes press on continue finally it's going to give you a summary of what you're going to be doing about creating the virtual machine then press on create create one more time here it is. So now what we're going to do is, now uh, in, on VirtualBox, we're going to press on the virtual machine that we have created, and then we're going to press on Start over here. Once we press on Start, dismiss the message of the uh, auto keyboard, and then continue. Yes. Now this is where you're going to choose the ISO file of Windows 8, the consumer preview version that you have downloaded. In my case, it's on the desktop, so I'm going to press on that folder over here. Desktop, Windows 8, Consumer Preview, 64-bit.iso file. I'm going to choose that one, open it up. It's going to read it, and then press on Continue. Press on Start, and like this, uh, it's going to start the installation of Windows 8 on your newly created virtual machine. Here it is, the installation is going to start, yes. You're going to select the language that you want, the time, the currency, and everything. Press on Next. Install now. Once you've pressed on Install now, you're going to get this window. And over here, you're going to enter your key code. And as I said, the key code, or the product key, is in the description below. And it is valid at all times, because this version of Windows 8, the consumer preview version, is provided for free by Microsoft. So simply type down over here the product key that is provided in the description below, press on next, and then the installation will proceed normally as you would expect. And after that, the virtual machine is going to reboot 
and Windows 8 is going to open up then you may start using it and remember it's only a consumer preview version it's not the full version of the operating system and that's it for this video so uh, let me now put it aside VirtualBox okay uh, once again that's it for this video uh, thank you very much for watching please remember to subscribe and if you have any comments leave it below